Hello, good evening, everybody. Hello, hi, Kai Wen. How are you? Hey, oh, Ren, you just came from the hospital. Hey, have you eaten? Have you eaten? Don't worry. After lesson, uh, Uncle Raymond will take you to eat the hospital, okay? Don't talk to Kai Wen. Okay. Ah, Kai Wen, you see, he eats it. You see. 很过分！你看这个凯文自己吃，不要不要跟我们学。你看啊，吃到津津有味啊。<笑> OK， children， good evening everyone。Say thank you for coming in。啊 ，Where are you, Rex？ Rex， I don't want to see your hair， Rex。啊 ，This is one of my most naughtiest students I have。Rex， <笑> just kidding， Rex。How are you？ Take your lunch ready， Adina？ Yes， yeah， lunch. yeah。OK， good。All right， thanks。Where's my where's my dog? Oh, my dog is behind me. Okay, can you see it? Please turn on the camera. Remember, today is the last lesson for April, and I'm going to submit your student performance appraisal to your parents and uh, to you as well. So this is the last uh, lesson for this month. We are talking about these four things here. Now we're going to. Oh yeah, and also with some of your homework, huh? Let's go to some of it. Let me see where is the phone. Ichi, did I go through your homework last week? Ah, Ichi, where are you, Ichi? Did I go through already? Ten you also right? Ten you also ah? Ten you ah? Ten you did I go through your success and failure? Mine, I think you did. If I'm not wrong, I I remember I did. Okay, now I just in case ah. All right, okay. If you want, we can just do it again. Okay, today I would like you to do this one here. I'm not sure you received your lesson plan for this week. Okay, for group introductions. Now, I'm not sure how you feel it like for introductions. How are you going to do it? How do you do introductions? So this is how we do it. We use D A T E. I want this. I already want to go on one, but I'm really lonely. So, <clears throat> I, I I can't get you. It's lagging just now. I'm so sorry. What do you say? Nothing. It's irrelevant. Huh? It's irrelevant. Oh, okay. So, is he? Why are you laughing? <laughs> okay. Uh, this is the first time. Right, Warren? You see this before? No, right? No. Uh, okay. So, what I'm going to do now is that there are three methods. Of doing the introductions for an essay, so this is one of the methods. We're going to see into it. But the first method is called DATE. Date. Okay, dialogue. I think Rex, we went through that day, right? Rex, did we go through? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we did. Okay. So never mind. Ah, just recall. Ah, because that day you're using it for your argumentative essay. Remember, right? Yeah. yeah. So we are going to do it for narrative essay. So, uh, Rex was because that day he was not well, so I asked him to join in to recover back the lesson. How to start a good introduction using date? So first, we must have a dialogue. Well, it is indeed a sunny and beautiful morning. As Tim Peter has he woke up in an exciting mood. Okay, this is very childish, which is like primary school. But I'm just giving a simple how to start an introductions. Right. Okay. Since uh, Warren today are on 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 camera, right. So for example. Ah, we all the girls here. All the girls are Tian Wu, Zi Ye, lah, Zi Ye. I don't want to see the Mister B, lah. I want to see your face. So all the four girls here. When you meet a new a a a new friend or boyfriend, okay, right? Girl, girls meet boy, lah. Boy meets girl, lah. Correct, lah. Right? Can you, Yang Zhen? Yang Zhen, don't tell me you want to be a new boy. I think the one, lah, girl. Okay. So, ah ah, Ha Ling so happy, yeah. Brush his teeth. <laughs> okay, I just sorry. So, what is the first thing you will you do? Okay, guys, in three four years, you're going to go for your A levels, right? In your JC in the poly, right? The first time you meet a new friends, okay, Warren, what is your first thing to do? Okay, regardless of girl or boy or LGBT lah, let's be honest ah. Okay, as long he's not from alien, not from Mars. Your first step. Say hi. Say hi, right? Okay. Okay, if someone were to say to you, "Ah, Iti, hi," do you think this person is rude? No, I wouldn't say so. Ah, I like the way you say that. I would. Okay, so yeah, what do you think if someone say hi? May I know what's your name? 
What will you do to it? I'm starting my lesson already. Oh, please, please. Thanks for calling to kick off with the word hi. Nothing wrong, huh? I think it's very common now today. Huh? So yeah, what will you do? How will you um, feel? Um, who, like who says? Is it some random person? No, you, it's a brand, it's a stranger. You are, you're going stranger. To, ah, let's say you are now in the JC, okay? Okay, let's say now you are in uh, NJC, National Junior College. Huh? Then you met this person, whether girl or boy or LGBT, or, uh, okay? Then that person say, hi, what is your first impression? Um, the first thing I will think of is do I know the person or not? Because um, if the person is someone who doesn't know me also, I'll probably not say, I'll probably just say hi more away. Okay, back, re reciprocate, right? He hi to you, you say hi to you. Okay, fine, thank you. Tian Lu, now you are in the JC, huh? Ah? So same thing, Tian Lu, you experience the same as Warren, Yi Qi, and Zi Ye, huh? Uh, this person come and say to you, hi. Okay, person one, uh, say hi. Then you walk, walk, walk. The other person also say hi. That person, also, hi, hi, hi. Everyone also say hi to you. How will you feel in this school, NJ? Or let's say, no, say NJ. Like, okay, like, we use example for NJ. How will you feel? Chen Lu, Chen Lu, how will you feel? Uh, I will feel very weirded out. Very what, sorry? I will feel very weirded out because like, Usually, people don't behave in such, like, don't like, uh, usually people don't like just say hi all the time. Exactly. Thank you, Tian Ru. Like, Warren, can you imagine uh, you go to that school, say hi, hi. Then you just, you know, tea, gao, how come uh, this school uh, limited vocab word? Uh? So, uh, hi, you can you talk about other you feel very weird, right, children? Can you imagine, ladies and gentlemen, if you start off an essay, uh, Warren, imagine you're the marker. Uh, you got 30 students all start like that. Hi, how are you? That's the second How is your marker? Sorry? Examiner, examiner. Marking, marking, marking a, a paper. Marker, marker, yeah. Not the marker, la, the, not the marker as in marking the paper. La. Honey. Hey, yeah. Okay, how she and hi. So, Tianlu, how, uh, Warren, how will you feel? Imagine 30 of your students say, hi, how are you? Hi, how are you? Boring, right? Seriously, you can predict the number seven and number eight and number nine students was doing the same, correct? Right? True not. Now, what happened if one of those students say, hello, my name is Warren. Nice to meet you. May I know what's your name? Wow, there is something. So this is the one I'm telling you. I want you to be, your introduction to be 经济独立. 特别的, special, extraordinary, right? Rex, I told you before, right, that day during lesson, right? You must be someone that is very special. That is the most important, right? That is how you start off the dialogue. The actions, quickly, Peter rushed to the toilets to brush his teeth and wash his face. Okay, that's action, very simple one, huh? Tone, indeed, Peter is looking forward to this, for these vacations, and he felt that it was be wonderful and a wheel of time. Ah, fist ball. Okay, right, so positive tone. Expression, Peter was feeling so refreshing and full of energy as he proceeded to the kitchen. Practically, indeed, for this P-D-A-T-E, the whole entire, this part here is just the, only the introductions. Now, I want to ask for vote now. How should you just came in? Please turn on the camera. Yang Zhen, let's start from you. Uh. Okay, a quick one. Uh. Five seconds, if you don't reply me, it's not angry. Uh. I got to move on. Uh. So with this introduction like this, uh, would you want, number one, uh, Ting Hao, uh, would you want to continue to read the second, the third, and the fourth paragraph, okay? Second one is that, <clears throat> if you were to start the second paragraph, Yang Zhen, how are you going to start? Ready? Okay, Professor Yang, your turn. Liu, Liu, Professor Liu. Is it Liu, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Professor Liu, come. So... Would you want to My question oh. number one, would you want to continue this essay? Yeah, I would. Okay, so how would you continue if you are the author? How will you want to continue the second paragraph? Uh... Look, uh, you guys are leaders, uh, not Singapore students, uh, international students. Uh. 
So think internationally and think like a leader. That's the next month topic, leadership. Huh? Mm, I will probably explain what I meant in the first opening because it's kind of vague. Very good. Yes. Uh, staycation, but I mentioned staycation. What? So the, the reader might want to know, hey, how come this Peter got the chance to go staycation, correct? Right? Maybe uh, you see he got a good result. Or maybe because uh, the, the, the mommy passport expired, cannot go overseas, correct? Right? Right. Uh, you see, use your creative juice. Thank you, Yang Chen. Back to you, Tian Yu. Will you want to continue? You don't want to continue? Uh? Why? Mm. Huh? Wait, we're doing it for tea, right? No, no, no. Let's say you, you finish this paragraph. Will you want to, to continue to read the next paragraph? No, <clears throat> no, because it looks, it looks very boring. Okay. I, yeah, I think uh, I think you might be spending a bit. I mean, no, I think that you are like, it's either very dry or it's like you're just explaining the like not so important stuff the a lot. Ah, uh, fair enough. Uh, fair enough. I take your your feedback. So how are you gonna improve it? Is uh you, you have to modify the, the content. Fair enough. Okay, right. yeah. Thank you, Tian Yu. Honestly, yes, I will continue it because every story to me is worth reading in some way. Ah, it lies. Okay, every story worth reading. Yeah. It might be a boring introduction, but we do not know the body of the story, right? Yes, fair enough. But honestly, I agree with Tian Yu. Uh. If your introduction is sucks, uh, you give people a wrong impression with you. Let's be honest, okay? Thank you. So how are you going to continue for the next paragraph, honey? I mean, it will be like what Yang Chen said. Elaborate on like the uh, staycation, why they could get staycation and things like that. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, you see? Yes, uh, for, his, uh, yeah, for his point, right, I agree that like, if you're if you're gonna write something like this, you your next paragraph will have to jump either like to the main point of your story. If not, it's gonna get very boring, and the person like the marker will read it. Right? It's gonna he's like he or she will like will just lose most of the interest already. So exactly. There's nothing, as there's nothing also must like try and. Wow, well, today like, you're creative. Try them. I should give you nine marks already. Really. Tell you well done. Well, you're well said. Like, seriously, because. Uh, later on, uh, Quarren and the rest of you, Ziye and Tian Yu, uh, later we got three different types of introduction by an IP student. Uh, okay, from an IP student. I want you to analyze to see which one do you think is more interesting. Okay. Uh, to put that, uh, you mind? Uh, who's, who's that? Uh? Okay, let's move. Okay, you see your turn. Yeah, I would like to continue. So if you are the, the, the author, right? You're, if you are the writer, how do you continue the second paragraph? I think I will say something bad happened and this staycation was cancelled. Oh, so you are referring... I did not give you the title, huh, children. Uh, until today, uh, now, uh, not, not today, until Yang Zhen, Tian Yu and Han Ling, uh, I did not tell you what is the title of the story, correct? Huh? Well mm -hmm. done. So it's a twist of the, the, the story, yeah? Yeah, like Thank maybe you. he never bring passport, then cannot go. I know, I know, that one is my idea, like, don't steal my idea, leh. You can't talk about when mommy wants to eat, she's going to eat chicken pox, maybe she's going to eat chicken pox. Yeah, copy my idea. Okay, 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 okay. Ah, so, but C1, in the conclusion, the ending, uh, you must really bring the moral of the story. That's very important. Okay, thank you. Uh. Okay, so yeah, your turn. Would you want to continue the story? Huh? Yeah, do we want to continue the story? Hello? Oh. So yeah. That B is actually creepy. Wow. Oh, 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 would you want to continue to read this story? You know, this, this, this is the, only the introductions uh, by using DATE. Uh. Would you want to continue the next paragraph? Uh, um, 
It's only a yes or no. Yes. Why? Um, because it's interesting. Okay, how will you continue the next paragraph if you are the author? Um, I'm not sure. Okay, never mind. Thank you. Okay, Kai Wen, your turn. Would you want to continue this story? Uh, probably not. Why? Because uh, like what can you say? It's like quite mundane and I don't think it can really attract the, the attention. Word you use, man. I love the word mundane. Well done. Okay. Yeah. So very mundane and make it marvelous. Law. Like the marvelous comic like that. You're so bad. Yeah. Uh, write it. Write that story. You don't want to share with me and with others. This is called friends. <laughs> okay, well, uh, Kai Wen, Kai Wen, so yeah. since you know this is introduction is quite boring, you just put it to the side, okay, to the side, to the side, to the side, to the side, how will you change the second paragraph? Second paragraph or the first one? How will you do it? If you are the author, how are you going to make this more interesting? Uh, I think it will be like quite interesting if you like just started it with like a suspenseful moment later in the story or or like maybe like a weird line of dialogue that like the context is only derived from like the later part of the story ah the twist of it okay thank you so much mm, thank you. it's like you can't judge a book by its cover mm. wow you use this spot but well done maybe the contents are interesting but unlikely but exactly first impression yeah thank you yeah. Han Ling. Thank you so much. Exactly what I'm talking about. Every time I mark my as my student essay, I will talk about content, the structure, and the grammar. This is how I mark. Don't question me. How come my way of marking is different from the school? Sorry, this is all along. I've been marking this for thirty years, and you, I will die die will not change this. Okay, I've done my research. This is my own research. I'm a very egoistic for this part here because I find that content exactly. Thank you, Hanley. You speak from my heart. The content, the name, is very important. The structure and then the grammar. Grammar is is more important. So it's the same thing. Ah, thank you. Since we are into this context here, so the content, ladies and gentlemen, later we're going to give you a a a a special a a very um surprise special. Ah, ah, this is where ah Han Ling was talking about. So I will explain to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, lah. Yesterday cannot leave, ma. Yesterday cannot leave. Oh, Jia, you're like yesterday. You like uh, you want to do, and after that, me and someone else submitted. So late, they like okay, never. We give next week. Yeah. So today we do it lah. Okay. Thank you. Now back to you, Warren. Will you want to continue this story? Um, I will like read the second paragraph and then I decide because like from the first paragraph, I feel like um it is very nice and descriptive. However, um. There isn't much of a conflict in the first paragraph. I feel like in order for a story to be like very um, attention catching, the a uh, like a conflict should be present in the first paragraph to get us very curious, because like over here it just seems as if it will be like a diary or a journal that will be just be talking about Peter's vacation and like. It's not that fun. However, like if I read the second paragraph, I see that it has potential to be like an interesting story with like a good climax, and I might continue reading it. Thank you, thank you, Warren. Okay, very detailed explanations. Back to you, Chenru. What do you think? Would you want to continue or don't want to continue? Uh, I would want to continue because. Sometimes you can't judge like a story from like the beginning. If it's if it's like the story is, it might be just the things that like very normal or something, but it might be very different in in other in a in other in other paragraphs. So I just continue reading it. I see. Okay, now I'm I'm waving to my 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 tutor who came to tutor my son, man. Okay, Chenru, I think today ah uh, the girls are doing very well. Okay, good answer, Chenru. Uh, it's just like since you said um the introduction introductions 
is still very vague and continue the second, third paragraph. You know, Ah Lu, next time you are going to face the real world, huh? you go to look for a job, okay? You just graduated from university, ah? then you first think that you got, you got a, a job, first day in the office, ah? okay? Then this stranger came to approach you. You don't know who is he, ah? it's a guy. Ah? He came and shake hand with you, all right, Tianlu. So how are you going to shake hand with him? Is it a firm grip or just like that? Look at a uh, high like that, you know, uh, or just simple shake handshake. Or if that person will say, oh, hi, nice to meet you. Uh, I'm Peter. I'm the CEO of this company. Oh my gosh. Huh? Or he, did that, he didn't tell you that he's the CEO of the company. He say, hey, hello. Hi, I'm Peter. Nice to meet you. Uh, you first day here, huh? What is the first impression? Oh, so what do you think? If the person tell you, hello, Jenu, I are you? I'm Peter. So this is the first impression, but you never know, right? He might be testing you to see what is your reactions, right? To test you on that. So yeah, so it's true, I agree, Jenu. Sometimes the introductions is really giving you a lot of a, a, a background of this person, of that person. Thank you so much. Rex, what do you think? Do you want to continue or not? Yeah, sure. You want to continue? Then how do you continue the next one? You sound um, so uncertain. No, she he's paise la and shy la. Don't like that. Okay, Rex, come. Huh? What do you think? How uh, do you feel the next paragraph? So you want, right? You want to continue, right? So how you continue the second paragraph? What would you write for second paragraph? Right, so why are you asking? I'm oh. asking Rex how whether she, she he like he likes to continue or not. Oh, okay. okay. Yes or no? Yeah, it's uh starting. Uh, I want to know whether um what's the what's the next story to. To this, this storyline. Okay, uh, Rex is a uh, boy. Uh, Rex is a, a student uh, who like to watch a lot of the 80s and 90s movies. Uh. And one of them recently, I introduced him the Zhou Xing Si, right? Huh? That, that movie, very nice. Uh. <laughs> I'm not sure you watched it. Before. Okay, thank you. Uh, Hao Xian, your turn. Hao Xian, are you there? Please turn on your camera. If not, I'm going to lock you off. Thank you. Are you there? Man, he is not that. Hanley, bang wa da uh send ge ta jia na turn on camera. Do my Hanley, thanks. Hao Xian, are you there? He is not. Okay, I send a message to the parents now. Okay, guys, thank you so much. Actually, you are right on Warren. You hit the jackpot. This story is actually for a primary students. Okay, for a primary school students. And the title is... So, the... what did you uh, read? Uh, I, I, bet, I bet you're going to say that. Oh, it's written by my child. <laughs> <laughs> so, Warren, you're right. The title is called A Disappointing Event. So what happened is that they went for staycations, they got these things and all the, the whole thing upside down. They did not have a good uh, uh, staycations. But later on, there was some twists of it, like what Han Ling and Kai Wen was talking about. Yes, and Yi Chi, yes. Like the passport, all these things. Yeah, you're right. One of the reasons is also similar to that. So well done. Uh, but that doesn't mean this is a premise kids uh, uh, essay. It doesn't apply to secondary school or to even to JC or even to university. The formulas are there. It's just like foreign. Half base time high is for primary school, right? Do not, right? Half base time high. Is this half base time high formula going to use in your secondary school? Yes, right. We use that, right? Do not. We definitely use it, right? But that is the foundation. Tuima, Kai Wen, right? Tuima, Rex, Tuima, Tianru, Ziye, and uh, Yang Zhen, you agree, right? Okay. Now let's move on to the next one here. You see, I'll give you another method. See, dialogue. Rise and shine, Biden. 
wake up, it's time to go to school, say mother with a calm and calm voice. So this is also a primary school one. Huh? Okay, so the reason is I'm using the SMAR. Yeah, what, what do you find on this primary school compost? I would like to know. No, no, I, wait, later I will give you the IP one. I just want to get, give you a, some simple idea. Wait, okay. you're going to give us an IP one? Oh no. Wait, wait, IP one coming. Then home, Ryan's room, or these are all the settings, okay? These are all the settings. The main characters, okay, wait, nah. and then this is the dialogue here. Okay, then move on. So we have the main characters. These are all the people that are involved. Later, when in the IP, the papers, then take a look. Huh? So atmosphere, happy, nervous, excited, frightened, worried. Okay, that's the atmosphere. And as happy as a lung, rhythm, about five to six paragraphs. Wake up, idea one, that is the second paragraph. When you say idea one is second paragraph, because it already covered the DATE, the, the first paragraph. Then idea two, idea three, idea four. This is my P4 boy, uh, honey, my, friend, my son, uh, the essay. So uh, it also can apply it later on, okay? So finally, the conclusion, what have you learned? Always the conclusion as the moral of the story, okay? Right? Failure is not end of the road. He believed all this thing here. Okay? Discipline and determination. Okay, just a quick one. Huh? So the title is Disappointing Event. So actions. Ryan, Ryden's realized that today is his birthday and also he's taking part in the guitar competition. He felt excited, nervous, and happy. So tone, Ryden's parents were happy to see it, um, ready to ready for the a brand new day. And Ryan's parents greeted, good morning, son. Happy birthday to you. We shall celebrate your birthday. And after your guitar competitions, the parents in an awesome tone while Ryden were, was tying his shoelace. So there's this picture in PSR, we got three pictures, right? One is the birthday, and the other one is the guitar competitions, and the third one is tying a shoelace. So using all the three pictures. Expressions, Ryan was, uh, was like a dog with two tails. Uh, he stopped, ready to start a brand new day with blah, blah, blah here, with a great start. Okay, now, so this is the expressions that, okay, was a dog with two tears. Then this is where you continue the second, the third, the second and third paragraph to come in. How, Shen, is that you? Yeah. Why just now, was that you just now? Uh, I don't know. I cannot hear anybody, so I just logged off. Okay, thank you. So how, Shen, would you want to continue the story just now? Oh, you cut your hair, okay. Wait, I need to go over to your house and we'll have to cut IG real quick. Where are you going? To his house to give him a cut IG. Going? You are going to lock off? Hello? Hello? No, no, sure, sure, sure. He met it as a joke. <laughs> because every time you someone gets a new haircut, you want to say, I like your cut G in this man. That's like them in your head. Ah, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Thanks, uh, unfortunately for you, you can't. I see, I see. Well, very good. Huh? You, you have to play along with it. Okay, how Shen, would you want to continue the story just now? What story? Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, I have to start again. He, 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 he wasn't here, remember? No, he was there. Well, just now somebody locking for him. He couldn't hear. Here. Yeah. But he, he couldn't hear. Couldn't hear. The story. He couldn't hear, so he technically won't want to. Yeah. Well, okay. Would you want to continue the second and the third paragraph? That's what one, was my question that I asked all of them. What was it? Wait, what's the question? Would you want to continue this? the next paragraph for this story. Let me see that. Yeah. DATE is the formula to start your introductions. Okay. Dana? Okay. Would well, you want to continue? What do you mean by continue? Like you continue reading or you continue the story? Would well, you want to continue the story? Now? Will you feel good about these introductions and then you want to read the second and the third and the fourth paragraph? Do you think this introduction is good enough? Yes or no? Yeah, it's good enough. So you want to continue to read? Lah? Yeah. You feel good. Okay, now guys, this is the IP paper. Okay, I would like you to do this three. three uh, let's do an essay one. Okay, never. And you guys are going to write the second paragraph. Uh, there's, this is a, a, a homework. Huh? So, ready? I will get Tian Lu to read the first one, please. Never. Never is a word that is heavy with meaning. It is a word that has an edge 
like when describing something final, when we say never, we completely shut down any possibility of something happening. It is akin to snipping a rose in a bud to stop anything, whether dangerous as thorns or as beautiful as a fragrant, fragrant flower from growing. Thank you, huh? Chen Lu, this is the first, first essay, huh? essay one, huh? okay, from Lynette Tan. Huh? This is direct from my ex-students from the IT school. Huh? So Lynette Tan, too true, but you can see it's 2017. Huh? By now, you're already in a, in a, in a uni, university already. So this is the one. I want all of you here, you have to choose one that you think is that worth to read the next paragraph. Okay, and then later on, you guys are supposed to write the second paragraph. Then Wait, well, we, have to, we have to continue writing some super smart person's essay. About then? About then? Do you want to do well? Uh, about then? Yes. Huh? Uncle Raymond. <laughs> okay, Joe, Joe, Joe. Okay. Okay, guys, thank you, Arsenu. All right, so this is your first one. So you have to decide whether you want to continue. Do you think this is a good essay to continue? That is why I uh, eat. Just I ask all of you, right, whether you like to have this uh, essay, uh, how do you find you want to continue or not? The reason I'm asking is very important. Because as a marker, as a teacher, and in future, you yourself, when you're reading your children's essay, straight away you know already, roughly you can tell the next few paragraphs is going to be a good essay or lousy essay. Of course, it will be good that if you can do a draft by doing the S-M-A-R-T, regardless of whatever essay you're doing, okay? Uh, I'm called this... Uh, I will share you next month. Uh. It's called R, R2 and D2. That means A stands for argumentative, R stands for recount, E stands for explanatory, explanatory, narrative, discursive, and descriptive. So I'm going to cover all these aspects as, ma as many lessons as possible. Now back to you. I will get the girls to read. Uh. Don't mind. It's here, your turn. Never had I expected someone so different to have changed me. When I was in my final year of primary school, I invested all of my trust in believing that change was associated with similarity. If I hung out frequently with someone similar in interest and behavior as me, I would change my own thoughts and actions to match her personality to get along with her more. Wow, this is a one word essay, never means what? Well, this one I say too a bit complicated, huh? Whoever do this, good luck to you. Huh? Right. Sounds very interesting. Thank you. Warren, your turn. Never. What does the word never really mean? If someone says, never have I, it means they have yet done the deed. But if they say, never will I, it could also mean they will not do it in the future. Growing up, kids say many nevers because they are still naive. Never will I smoke, never will I do drugs, but how many of these children actually hold to what they say? No, I have never smoked. I have never done drugs, but I did something worse, much worse. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think this one is more interesting to read, huh? uh, because I do smoke before, huh? but I never take drugs. Oh yeah, I do take drugs. I do, I do, I, I took drugs. I took a lot of drugs. MSG. I know drugs is Panadol, la, please. La. MSG. <laughs> drugs please. is also flu vaccine. La. But you know recently, uh, E.T., uh, uh, Ziyue and Ken Yu and Yang Chen, I think you know, right? Recently got this uh, Indian guy was hanged on Wednesday. That is uh, two days ago. Is it for us Wednesday? Yeah, Wednesday. Uh, he, was, uh, he was hung um, because of uh, he was bought drugs to Singapore in 2009. Uh, 33 years old from Malaysia. You, you don't know about this news? Uh? Hai Wen, you know? You know? This news? You know? You know? You know? You know? You know? You know? So a lot of people in Malaysia and Singapore uh, also appeal uh, not to hang him because he got low IQ, because uh, he was too young and naive uh, by pushing the drugs to Singapore, trafficking the drugs. Uh, yeah. Yes. No, okay, I'll, I'll, you finish what you're saying first so I can like, say something. So I think, yeah, okay, uh, thanks. So I think that um, whether should I give like Tong Ching Ka, 33 years old, 10 years ago, he was only 22 or 23 years old, so he know nothing, poor thing, right? 
I'm so sorry, uh, if that should, uh, if my children or my grandchildren, whoever do drugs, uh, I will feel very sad and very bad. Uh. But you have to understand that uh, a lot of people are saying Singapore should not carry out this death sentence for drugs. I think China, right, uh, Taiwan, is China still consider that if you are selling drugs, you also death sentence, right? Anyone can tell me, is it true? Is it still on? Ah, Yang Zhan, you know? Is it true? Uh, I, I'm not very sure about it because the problem of drug usage is not brought up a lot in Chinese media. Yes, it is. Any dealing with drugs in China is just an instant death sentence. That's good. That's okay. good. You have to, especially the opium war, right, that caused China to lose Hong Kong and Macau. 50 grams or more. Yeah, that's good. Thank you. I, I think I support that. But these people say, no, you're very inhuman, you're very cold-blooded, you're you beast. Look at those Europe countries uh, who are like taking drugs and nobody business and create a lot of havoc. Talking about when change human rights. So yeah, I just want to share since we are talking about never will I do drugs. Please don't do anything stupid. Uh. Drugs it really destroy the whole entire family. Okay, I have I have heard that uh, when this uh, narcotic officer came to my ex school, uh, what happened is that he, he shared with us that when he suddenly went to uh, went to check on the house for drug trafficking, this guy who was a drug addict with drugs, literally from a fifth or seventh story, jumped down from the, from the HDB block. He literally jumped down and killed himself. Seriously, because a drug addict will go into cold turkey, uh, it's really very, very scary. You cannot get rid of the drugs addictions. Okay, now. Hey, 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 hey. So can I say something about the earlier? Oh, yeah, yeah, so sorry, yes. Uh, that one. Okay, so. Uh, I know. Uh, I know. Like even I would say, like you should. Like I will tell the judge to not hang him, but like just give me a long jail sentence. But then on the other hand, you have to remember that he is not just harming his own. I it's mean, not like, just not what? People, no, no, even if like first, if I'm not wrong, you said something like he was being pushed right because he has low IQ. That's why people easily fool him to like bring drugs over to Singapore. Am I right? No, but you cannot use that as an excuse to not ask him to get hanged. Because like he's if he if the drugs actually goes out, then he's harming more people than one. So he's so in other words, the judge hanging him is like is like using sacrificing one life for like many others instead. No, what you say okay, is okay. exactly true. Exactly true. This was uh no, no, this one is like, you have to think about this, uh, but honestly, I don't think he should have done like I think he I don't think he should have like I don't think Jack should have killed him, but like give him a long sentence or at least like train him, like teach him or something. No, no, don't waste money. Uh, taxpayer money. Uh, uh, and too easy, you know, one two just go and go. Okay, I, I don't sympathize people who sell drugs. Uh. There are a few group of people that should have death sentence. One if one of them is kidnapped. The other one is the selling those girls and children for, for trading for sex, uh, for, for slavery. That one, okay? This one is the destroying family. The third one, of course, would be drugs. Okay, these are the people I think should be. And there's a reason why, can you, I would like to be a criminal lawyer. And I always waiting for this type of case to really make sure to pin them down to the death sentence. Really, I seriously, I, I find that this time, because from young, I've been looking at so many stories, especially now, it's still vivid in my head about the opium war. You know, how many, how many thousands and thousands of people suffered during this opium war, okay? And, and it's so bad, no? And all these drugs are all created by the Westerners. And how come they don't want to consume? And now it's a power that going back to that side. So I agree with you, uh, Taiwan. It's a withdrawal symptoms. It's very, very hard, seriously. To be honest, uh, when I quit smoking, uh, Taiwan, I was very heavy addicted to my smoking many years ago. When I could quit smoking, it's not easy, especially my surrounding, all my friends are, especially I, I speak up smoking even before my army time. Okay, so it's really bad for my health and also affect my three children. Because of smoking, uh, it affect my three children's health. So it really will pass down, I'm serious. Don't even think of, hey, the word try, don't even think of picking out, even let's say next time your girlfriend or your boyfriend uh, smoker, please ask them to seriously. Smoking is really very bad as well as drinking alcohol or taking drugs. All right, children. Now let's come back to this three essay. I want you to have a deep talk. So I'm going to search the essay up for you guys. All right. But in the meanwhile, 
uh, there are two tasks for all of you to do. Let's say I start first. Uh, okay, honey, I start first. Say, for example, I love number three so much. Okay, I will use number three as my introductions. Where is my D A T E? My D will be definitely never have I, right? Uh, Boren, there's a dialogue, right? There's a D, yeah? Okay, A, uh, if you forget what is A, A is the actions. Okay, the actions, then the tone. Huh? So the actions, what is the action for number three? I mean, it's a bit small, sorry. The actions will be, you say, what does the word never really means? So this is like to creating a tone. You see the way, uh, I like the way uh, Boren, never will out, never we are do drugs. That kind of tone is like very confident of Boren. It's just like Warren, you will tell mommy, uh, mommy, as it is coming, I confirm I will not touch your hand for, for the next five days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Warren. No way, you're not going to touch your handphone, right? You know what happened? Uh, uh, you see, I got these few students, uh, he, he's so addicted to handphone until the mommy bought Nokia handphone for them. You know, Nokia is only pressing number, right? Sure. No I'm addicted to it more because it's Nokia. They got no apps, so it's so pathetic. Bro, the, the main reason why you will buy Nokia for your child is because you just don't like your child at all. No, no, because my students keep using the handphone to play the what crush candy. Uh. You know, last time was crush candy, uh. very lame day. Candy, like, crush. Uh, candy crush, uh. okay, crush candy, candy crush, whatever. Uh. So you're playing all these games. Uh. Until the mommy bought the Nokia handphone for him, for her and for him too. Uh, you see, they refuse to bring the handphone to school. Right? The handphone for, for them uh, is like, 儿子,你现在在哪里?在学校. 儿子,你在哪里?在补习中心. 儿子,你在哪里?在家. Uh, 就是报一个平安, uh, you see. But the, three, the children don't want to bring the phone. Then you know why? You know why not? Because that's what, very lame there. Eh? Oh, my phone carrying three yeah, Nokia Nokia's are unbreakable. Yeah, but... You can throw no them against a coconut and the coconut will cry. Oh, yeah. But too bad. Nokia's are not able to survive in the real business world. So, you see, you know why it's very lame? All oh, my phone are using 3G phone and using Nokia phone. No means. So embarrassing. If the Ukrainians decided to take a Nokia and throw it at a Russian soldier, they'll have won the war already. <laughs> are you rapping? I am not. No rapping. It's reading, okay? Please, you speak very fast, that's all. Okay, now, now, the tone, what is the tone? As what you see, never will I do drugs. So you see, when Warrens are reading this, he's bringing out the tonality. What kind of tonality? Very overconfidence or very naive tone. Okay, the actions will be, I will choose, uh, what does the word never really mean? Uh, from this one, it's all full of action pack. And what is the expression? No, I have never smoked. I have never done drugs, but I did something Worse, much worse. Expression really. I'm going to express to you why that this word never to me is so serious. Ah, so I will continue. Ah. So in all flashback 10 years ago, when I decided that I'm not going to be a good friend with my friends because she has betrayed me. So I'm a girl. Ah. I'm the writing as a, a female writer. What happened is that one day when we were out together, I told her that I, I have a crush with this boy. Wow, she sabo me. She told me that uh, Ichi liked the boy also. Oh, so sad. Listen to the rhythm of the falling rain. Okay, so joke, ah. Okay, Ichi okay, okay. 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 So, I understand what I'm saying. So, I just use second paragraph. Then, of course, you have to know the third, what happened. Okay? The third and the final conclusion. So now, please choose your essay one, two, or three. When you are done for, for easy recognition, just type in the chat group. Okay, Rex, you can take part, please. Let's be clear that everyone here is just going to spam three, so I'm not going to put three. No, 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 just one only. My dear, Hale, no, 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 you see, you see. Because three is so exciting and well done, everyone's going to put three, so I can't put three. No, nothing wrong. If you want to do three, okay, one, two, three. This is purposely as selected from. Sorry, sorry. Someone, okay, uh, it's outside for my McDonald's supper. Okay, let's go. In fact, all the three stories are very, very interesting. Okay, seriously.
Okay, thank you, Quarren. Since you choose number three, oh, my dear, then you go and focus the second paragraph. Now, Quarren, the second, or all of you listening, uh, if you are doing the second paragraph, you no need to use the D-A-T-E already. You understand? You understand? All of you must write, uh, because later I'm going to show you the essay, how they wrote, okay? So you must write your piece. Okay, the best if you type it inside the chat group or even um, whiteboard. Lah. But I want to put it here. Lah. I don't want to take up. So please, you can type later then uh, WhatsApp to me also can. Thank you. Let me see, Steve. So uh, use this. Huh? Thank you. Monday, Monday, Monday. Yeah, Monday come. No, I'm talking to my wife, sorry. Monday, I want one. Monday, because Tuesday, Sunday, I'm going to to my new store at Scott Square. If you want, you can come and see me. Wait, 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 where? I'm going to Scott Square. Oh, Say again, I come. Uh, wait, can, can, Scott wait, Square. Wait, wait, wait. Chet, tomorrow, are you going to be at any of your shops? Oh, yeah, that's a good question, sir. Uh, no, on Sunday. Tomorrow, since me and HR don't have we might want to go find you. Oh, Sunday, Sunday. Ah, Sunday, no time. Oh, Sunday, ah. Sunday, Sunday will depend. Because I got new tuition. Oh, okay. But, uh, tomorrow, you at anywhere of your shop? No, tomorrow afternoon, I have a social study tuition. Then after that, my son is going for swimming. <gasps> yeah. wait, wait, wait. Then I'm going to prepare for next week lesson. Then Sunday morning, I'm going to Scott Square to set up my new store. Yeah, I may be going yeah. down in Plaza Sing. Uh, yeah, then, oh, Plaza Sing. Oh, because I'm putting my books in uh, Scott Square to, uh, on the 1st of May. My wait, book. Yeah, wait, what book you sell again? Yeah, no, it's inside here. Huh? The first page of the every single document that's him advertising. Oh, oh, that's the book. Oh, right. I, might, I, I, might, yes. I might get one. I might get At one. least you are very you pay attention, very uh loyal to it. Thank you. Okay. I saw Tian Yu choose one. Ichi choose two. Wow. Choose two. Uh, Ichi, well done. I saw Ha Ling choose one. Quoran also. Uh who haven't choose uh? Wait, what's the question again? Uh, uh I'm still thinking. Okay. They were one out of the three. Thank you, Zi Yue. Well, so I got a group of different. Uh, please write and then send it to me, ho. Oh. How many you finish it, yeah? Huh? Yeah, thinking right. Only one paragraph. Oh. I'm not asking you to write the whole essay. Huh? It's actually not that easy. You know what is called IP? <laughs> Let's be honest, right? I'm preparing you for university. I'm not preparing you for, for just step two, man. Come on. Rex, I really want to see your, your second paragraph. How are you going to write, man? <laughs> Tell you, huh? Then you, since you are always here for inspiration, I want to see your second paragraph. Come on. Yang Chen also, huh? So one or two? Kevin? Two, ah, okay. Wait, what's the question again? Who's that? Ah? Sorry, I did. Oh. You see, uh, how can you see? Is did you see question one? Uh, essay one, two, and three. Yeah. Screen right. You choose one of the essay. So which one will you choose first? You tell me first. Two. Two or huh? then you continue the second, second paragraph. Like, like under like a second paragraph. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yes, yes, yes. Do it. Do it. Do it. Correct. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay, Yang Zhen, number three, yeah? thank you. Please write the essay one, two, and three, the number, huh? Haling, I believe uh, this is the first time in your entire, li entire life doing like this, right? No, I've actually done one of these before, but I never managed to complete it. Ah, okay. But can you, is this the first time to continue? Yes, right? Yes. Uh, wait until the next one, uh, we go on Thursday one. Uh. Uh, we continue the story in different manners. Done? Wait, journal, Amma. So we need the thing. We need the thing. Yeah, wait, 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 wait. Not in time. I'll pang you, man. Okay, whoever choose one, I'll give you the idea. See, this is the second paragraph. Ah. No. Okay. Uh, Zi Yue, uh, no, uh, Yang Zhen, can you read the second one? When I was a child. When I was a child, the first never in my life was when my mother found out that me being well, dead. Well, well, why is mine so similar to this? <clears throat> maybe in my life was when my mother... Oh, wait. Uh, maybe I was not able to fully experience the impact of that never because that was, of course, a death baby. I can imagine the finally of, of the... A magic word your daughter will never be able to hear. When my mother heard them, it must have been like watching a boot stump and twist on the little sp sprout that was my future, rubbing it into the ground until it was nothing more than a mess of sap and crushed green pieces. My very first, my very first never for all the Finality. Finality is brought as is it, it brought was nothing more than temporary as I am still able to study and live our society. But that did not mean all that never in my life would be temporary. Wow, thank you, thank you very much. Let's read the next one. Huh? Okay, let's read the, this one here. Can you? Yeah. On the, on the other hand? On the other hand, if I were to meet someone whose attitude provided a stark contrast to mine, I would not even be bothered to follow their excellent example. That being said, I was insouciantly. Insouciantly, yes. Okay, insouciantly. Immature person when I was younger, and I would never have become who I am today if I had not met met Jen, Jane. I mean Jane in Jane, my previous Jane. school. Huh, Jane? Jen, Thank Jane. you. Her name is so weird. Taiwan? Never. What does that word never really mean? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. When oh, oh sorry, sorry, my bad. Mm. When I was little, my parents would always tell me family first, family would always be there for me. On television or in the movies, there was always that one teenage kid who locks herself up in a room and distances herself from everyone. I did not want to do that to my parents. So that's... That was how I started saying, I will never leave you. The leave was not just physically, but mentally as well. On their birthdays, I will never leave you. On Christmas, I will never leave you. And I really did believe so. Well done. This is more interesting. Honestly, I read uh, uh, last time before this essay was very good. Okay, uh? so I'm just giving you a head start of what these students have read for their paragraph here. So... No excuses. I will go back to the share screen 
and go back to this one here. Thank you. So all of you have read the second paragraph from three different essays and different aspects. In fact, all the three, the second paragraph are also going to lean, give you more expressions, more interesting fact to write for the next couple of paragraphs. And you realize their essays are very long. Now. IP student, your job is to start now. Continue to write at least four, five hundred words now, even in your set two. No more 350 words, please. Whoever has done it, please share in the Zoom chat, right? Of course, you must tell me which essay you're doing uh, because I'm not sure. Uh. The three of the essays are all very emotional. Uh, if you all can, uh, the second paragraph, can you add in your free spot like, like idioms or similes or proverbs or things like that, all right? Um, Uncle Raymond. Yes, who's that? Oh, yeah, Warren. Yes, sorry. Uh, so like, I chose the third one, right? Um, mm -hmm. It's like, they say like, uh, I did something that's much worse than smoking or taking drugs. And like, I'm wondering like, what is the limit? Like, how, how, like, what is the most serious it could be? Thank you for asking these questions. Uh, Warren, I hope, uh, please do not bring, oh, not you, uh, Anyone who are listening here, please do not bring your mentality and your concept in school and bring it here. Please be let your imagination to draw very well. As long as three things are foreign and all of you listening, no racism, no, uh, no sorry, no anti-race, no anti-religions, and no uh, against sexism. So, oh, because the worst thing is that I, I met with a Muslim boyfriend and then my parents don't like this Muslim and say that all Muslim eat pig. Not like that. Ah, uh, this is not Yeah, yeah. Uh, sorry, Yang Zhen. Uh, all Muslim eat big bao. And there's a big bao. Okay. Ah, this is not like that. This is not like that. You can write it like that. You can write it like that. Uh, I got this Muslim friend. I met this Muslim uh, as a husband. They don't like me, but finally they break away and they accept him as one of the members. Okay. At first time, I'm like very, very, uh, very anti this um, uh, Malays or anti Chinese, but slowly and surely and definitely they turn into a very harmonious. Yes, I can accept it. So, um, the best thing in the LT2, uh, this is the second paragraph. Uh, because you're going to end with a conclusion. What is the moral of this story? The moral of the story. What have you learned from this? Initially, the parents rejected you and your husband because they are different race, different religions, uh, things like that. And the best thing, uh, children, since you mentioned peace, I'm okay to talk about LGBT. I'm okay. So you know what's LGBT? Uh, all of you know. Uh, okay, uh? okay. If you don't know, please go and Google it. Uh, it's called lesbian gay. Uh, all this. I'm okay with it, but I'm so sorry, I'm it. You have to check now. Can you all please be kind enough 
to check with your teachers, are you allowed to write this kind of content inside your essay? Very seriously, important. Like our class learned that the hard way. You mean they ask you, honey, to dress like a girl? No, <laughs> we wrote about it. Oh, I thought they okay. Someone in my class decided to write about it. That's how. Yeah, then they ask. They need a model, right? So, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Harleen wearing the berry to do. Yay! Wow! <laughs> wow! Uh, that one is too much. Eh? That's considered sexual harassment, really. Like. Wait, home. wait, Uncle Raymond. Does okay? the does the never have to be like the theme of the story, or can it be like one you came up with yourself? I let it. I let your imagination flow, please. That's what Toro oh, okay. asked me. Thank you for asking these questions. Okay. You see, that's, uh, you all have never done a one word essay before, right? Have you all? Or uh, Kevin? Yuma, Kevin, Yuma. IP student? So you and Yuma? Tianu, Yuma? You have done a one word essay. By the way, huh, this one word essay, some of you, when you go to set three or set, good luck to you, huh, you will have, because you know my Warren and Kevin. 10 years ago, uh, for all level English, uh, they asked for one word questions, essay. Oh my gosh. They asked you for leadership, change, honors, honesty, um, dream. No, you see, the hard thing about a one word essay is sticking to the topic itself because it's just one word. Yeah, so nightmare, something like that. Thank you, Tianyu. For me, the word never was first used when I was three years old, when my parents found. Asthenius, a center of weakness where I can barely function like a normal human. Oh, wait, yeah, my bad. I forgot at some point. Is it true? Huh? It is clearly not true. You look at his... When I run, I can run. I put your daughter. I am not a girl. Wait, I haven't finished. I haven't finished reading, sorry. Oh, yeah, I can run for barely 20 seconds. Wow, the doctor told my mom. I actually changed the mom to mother, huh? Can you? Because it's a British uh, English, your daughter will never be a normal human. There's no way for her to act normally now. I'm sorry. Wait, I'm so far. Never will I. Oh, okay. So you can, 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 can you see the, 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 the purpose of today's lesson? To create the mood. Right. Uh, Very interesting, right? The first oh. paragraph and second paragraph. Yeah. Imagine, uh, can you, I ask you to stop here. Uh, Okay, Yang Zhen, Han Ling, Yi Qi, Zi Ye, Tian Lu, Guo Ren, Kai Wen, Rex, and Hao Xian. All of you continue the following paragraph. Then Tian Yu will end up the conclusion. Get it? Now? Wow, that will be a very interesting story. So Yi Qi will continue the third paragraph. Han Ling will continue. Everyone writes one. Oh my God. So can you see uh, well, the story getting more interesting, right? So you've got more and more ideas. This is to prepare you, Yi Qi, Tian Lu, and Zi Ye, for your exam, for your future. 你们听过七步诗吗? 听过吗? 紫豆燃豆诗,同诗跟本身,对吧? 请问你啊,那个曹币还是曹人, I always confuse 啊,在七步里面,他不能讲出那个为什么我不要杀你 It's really took the, a lot of courage and gut and creativity 的. Right, 梁振对吧? Right, seriously 好像你看李白啊,他就是想家,就是用那个什么,传前明月光了 so this is all, all these words are, are so powerful, to be honest. To me, uh, it's more powerful than max and size. Because one word itself can change a lot of the solid liquid and gases. So I find it's very important. And it will uh, kind of affect the way you think. All right, thank you, Han Ling. Um, hey, what essay is that, uh, Tian, uh, Tian Yu? Your essay, what? One or two? Please. One, uh, one, 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 one. Number one, is it? Can you? Okay. Yeah, I say one. Wait, I'm writing, I'm writing. Thank you. Okay, why is it? Uh, Harley, why don't you read? Uh? What? No. I read mean, your essay is easy. I don't want to read yeah. my own essay. Uh, Chair, don't worry. Uh, hey, Chow Sen, I will help you read your perfection. Okay, thanks. Come on, read. Harley. Okay, fine. This is pretty cringe because, um, it's pretty cringe. It's not for me it to read me. out. Wow. Rex, uh, Rex, can you read Hanley's essay now? Yeah. Uh, uh, where? Inside mm. the chat group. That, uh, I wrote it to you. 
Okay, you send to me. Hmm? Okay, my goodness. You yeah. send to me. You are supposed to send to everybody. Now I realize it. What? No. Okay, let's go. It's clean. Perfection. Oh, damn it. Um, well, even until now, that hidden, that hidden beauty still has not been discovered. And neither will that beauty burn with a flame bright enough to light up another's heart. It all happened faster than a flash, but the eternity of never lasts forever. Sometimes being cut down before they even grow is a blessing within a curse. When I was young, a reckless incident left me with something lost, and that was never and that was when this curse of never began. No matter how strong this word never is, I remain hopeful that I may someday be able to paint my life with a palette, palette of my own emotions. Wow. Wow. So, Han Ling, I don't know how you're going to end this essay. What are you going to teach the readers and the master like myself? What am I going to learn from your this very unforeseen or very sad, very catastrophic, very, uh, very bad um, uh, lifestyle that you have to change and transform it? Thank you so much. Chen Wu, can you read yours, please? Don't send to me or send to the whole whole class. What a beautiful message. Uh, excuse me. Um, okay, come, Chen Wu. My first never was the, the, the first time. Wait, which I essay? Uh? Sorry, you didn't mention. Uh, the first one. Okay. Never had I said to a sickly seat to a disgusting lesson that was forced to solo. An excruciating, painful task during that time. I remember that I had yelled and yelled using my remaining strength, tears streaming down my face, threatening to smash the damn you as poison bottle, <laughs> anything not to take the horrible medicine. I was two at a time and had abhorred any kinds of beneficial things, despite all the encouragements and punishments. Good girl, it's okay, very sweet, huh? Good girl, huh? You take a medicine, okay? Later, mommy will give you a sweet, sweet, huh? It's like, Jen will say, oh, you pain wall. <laughs> well done. So how are you going to extend the next few paragraphs? So imagine that I can think of our channel is that now you have become a mother. Okay, your child maybe not feeling well. You are going to give the same thing to your, your daughter or to your son. He or she also has the same expression like you when you are two years old. No, you can bring back the fresh bag. Huh? How are you going to do it? So then you think uh, now that means, uh, no, wait, wait. Now you are staying in United States of America. You are staying in US. Your parents are in Singapore. So, so now um, when your child is not feeling well, you are now in New York, uh, for example, because your husband is working in New York. So you are in New York. Now your child is not feeling well. You have to force him or her to drink the medicine. Where else the difference is that when you were two years old, okay, your mommy and your grandma are beside you. You know what I mean? Your mommy, mommy is there. You know why it's in that so he has one person to help him. But now you are a person in the United States. No one helps you. Then you think, wow, the situation that the situation that your mom feeding you with grandma is. You get what I mean? Then you mesmerize the love, the unconditional love of your mother. That you will never forget it. That's what Warren and Taiwan, you see? The word never itself, and thank you. Huh? Actually, I don't want to review, review the answer. Lah. If I got chance next two weeks, I'll show you. You are right. They actually, there's a twist of it. This is what, not just an IP student, this is what you guys, whether you're express or any or, or what IP, you're supposed to be, you are the director of this movie. The twist ending is supposed to be giving an audience, wow, that's more important, right? Thank you. So there's only three person who hand in, huh? Who else are not handing, please? By 9.15 or 9.20, I got to stop because I'm going to give you a surprise gift to all of you. Oh, Uncle Raymond, so it's just the first paragraph, right? Yeah, just the like second. Just like you see Han Ling and Tian Yu and Tian Yu submit. So Han Ling and Tian Yu and uh, Tian Yu, uh, your job now is to add in your first paragraph, the, the, the essay that you choose, right? The introductions. But you must... You must identify your homework. Huh? You must identify. Uh, Han Lee, can you help me? No? 
For example, this this one I use this one now. Uh, what does the the sorry? What does that word never really means? Can you put the a on top? Then you say never had I is a D dialogue. Okay, then the T the. Wait, I have to do that now. Yeah, yeah, right, right on top. Wait, wait, I can't like write. On... Where have an idea? Okay, 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 okay. I do, I do, I do. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, like this one, I put the A here. You, you don't use Yeah. Okay. Wait. Then this is just he just read the book, is dialogue, right? This I just put D. Understand? Ah, then this never will I do drugs. So this is your tone, right? Remember, ah, uh, our Warren, the way he, she read, never will I do drugs. Just very confident. Ah, I definitely won't touch that drug. Then the last part itself here. It's always the E, lah. Usually the E. Okay, so that's called the see, jump up, meet by ma. So you got two ways of doing it, lah. One is to, when you choose the essay. If you are choosing essay three, of course, I've already done for you. But you can disagree with me. You can change your own. All right. So that's ah uh, one. Number two is that you already completed your second paragraph. It's best that you complete your whole entire. A story for never. Okay. Uh, Hao Xian, instead of writing about this in English Chinese, uh, can you please type a proper essay now? Can you type a proper second paragraph? Okay, I just want to see that. Okay, so Chen Lu, Ah Han Ling, and Chen Yu, you can start thinking of your third, fourth paragraph with it. While the rest are still supposed supposed to hand me the second paragraph. Thank you. Wait, is the third and fourth paragraph uh, due now? Wait, what? Oh wait, 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 wait. Can you what do you want to say? No, I say is it due now? No, 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 no. Oh. You can start planning, my dear. Not oh. do now. I don't want you to do now. I really want you to. I'm giving you a head start to write this kind of essay. Okay. Actually, today this lesson is preparing for the IP student. Yeah. But of course, you guys will benefit lah. Regardless, I say whether you're IP Express, okay? How Shen? Can you stop stop doing the typing and start paying attention to write your essay now? I'm really doing it. Thank you. Wait, so if I complete the three paragraphs, do I put all three paragraphs here? No, no, no. Oh, you complete the whole story already? Yeah? No, only three paragraphs. Oh, no, no, no. It's I, I, been I don't 12 want to see minutes. I only want to see the second paragraph only. What's the young in the third paragraph? Just the young. Hey, they try like out. Can move your head. Okay, can. Yeah. Did not. Oh huh? No, I thought you like out. Never. Okay, Goran, you read your essay, please. This is the second paragraph. Huh? Okay, let's go. Never trust strangers. Those were words I had memorized by heart. Something that I would never do. Whether it be strangers on on the street or creep or creeps appearing in school, I will ignore them and report to trusted adults should they attempt to strike a conversation. Perhaps that was the reason why I was but a child when I received my first phone. My parents trusted me. With, my parents trusted me, thought me responsible enough to handle a phone by myself. An exalted device, an artifact that sparked jealousy amongst all friends. Of course, with such a rare piece of technology, I was glued to the flashy screen and colorful words. Less than a week in, I was assessing all sorts of websites and files, regardless oh, oh. of how ethical they were. Oh, what oh. Was myself curiosity. Well, never. Oh, oh, Warren, you naughty, naughty girl. And there's really, really know what he's gonna write about. I really more or less know what you're gonna write, but I'm so 拭目以待啊. 
that is the something. You see, as an examiner of market, I know roughly what the student is going to write, but I want to see what is the ending look like. Now, make a rental kind of like a uh, young child. You know, all everyone who watch movie like Avengers or Spider Man or Batman, whatever movies are. So why you don't always watch the bad guy will die, right? Always the bad guy will get punished, right? True now, young child, right? But at the end, you want to see how they die, how they are being punished under the law. Ah, something like that. Well done. Okay, thank you, Warren. So you go expand it. I hope you get a bit of twist. Maybe the phone that you're having, uh, that your parents don't trust it. Uh, I see, uh, because you use a phone, I uh, never study. But do you know maybe the phone has saved someone's life? Uh, that will be, I tell you, will be the most whoa, extreme awesome. How oh, Shana, your son is what? Ah, your son is what? What my son is what? Your your son is not your son. Then why I found your son is maybe? Your son is son is your son. Your son. Son is ma. Ah, S H I is ma. What? No. Then why is your son? Can you tell me? Confusion. Quite. So weird to put your own name. Wow, well, just do it. Oh, okay, thanks. I have Guo Ren, I have Han Ling, I have this uh, Ken Yu, I have Qian Ru, uh, I left Yi Qi, Zi Ye, Yang Zhen, Rex, and Kai Wen. Uh, mine is already on WhatsApp. You sent to me already? Uh? I didn't receive that. Did you? I'm so sorry. I didn't receive, so sorry. Where? I didn't see that. Uh, so yeah, what you're talking about, we have, but we are taught how to do. What is that? What are you talking about? Sorry, I didn't get you. I just saw your message. So yeah, why are you talking? Long time ago, what? Huh? You were asking about, uh, huh? One word. Oh, one essay, you're taught to do it. Okay, good. So you know, uh, this will come out in your set three and set four more, uh, more tougher. The one word essay is where is to prepare you for TSCs, uh, for your A level TSCs. Seriously, you have to start doing it. I have a lot of one word essay uh, behind my cupboards a lot, and I like one word essay. Seriously. Okay, so good. Uh, now you have to recall back. Uh, so. We are on the right track. So can we have the last essay before I want to show you a surprise key to all of you? Surprise is never a good thing. Oh, Shen, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, uh, later when Hao Xian come in, uh, I want to read his essay, uh, since it's out already, right? Hao Xian is out, uh, okay. So, uh, that is, I really prepared his essay. Uh. This is a surprise gift because it's very important and it's very encouraging, okay, seriously. Okay, who else? Who want to submit? Please keep your this essay well enough, and then if you can, um, uh, Guoren, Kai Wen, Yi Qi, Zi Ye, Tian Yu, Han Ling, Yang Chen, Rex, Tian Ru, and uh, Hao Xian, all of you, 
Can you please don't type it up? I want you to write it up. Wow, Kaiwen, the way you look at me, like not happy. Like, oh, ask me to write, you Xiao Uncle. Yes, write. Uh, Quarren, you also look at me. Oh. <laughs> hey, girls and boy, practice your handwriting. La, pu yao zi yang la, tui bu tui. You must have exams to use写的吗？对不对 ？Practice your handwriting, right? But if you really want to be defiant, ah, to type type law, I can't do anything, right? Type lah, it's okay. But I prefer you use your 手写。你懂为什么吗 ？Warren and Kai, the way you look at me, because at the end of the day, after many years, ah, if you keep this essay well, the paper might be turned very yellowish and very old, ah. But the moment you pass to your children or whoever to read, ah. Is priceless, I tell you. It's priceless because that's a handwriting. Warren, ah, 我亲生父亲是读华中的。当他去世的时候，有一天我心血来潮去找他的东西，我看到他写的华文字哦，非常的整齐，非常的端正，非常的有水准。我鸡蛋糕，我做他儿子，我的字啊，真的是哇，狗屁连天。So from that onwards, ah, I told myself I must be as good as my father. Even though she he had passed on many years ago, so that day I was sharing with my wife, my younger son, the way they write Chinese character. I asked my wife, "Have you seen my father's handwriting?" So yeah, definitely better than you. See, so please practice your handwriting. And I don't know why ah,、uh, our dear friends still haven't come in. Done, ready? Who else have not submit? Come on. Carry on, Rex. Read your answer, your your second paragraph. Come on, Rex. Read the、uh, during my teenagers. Oh, oh he read、yeah. for me. So in theory, I should read for him, right? Okay, can、oh. Hanling, Hanling read yours. Ah,、uh, Rex, no need to read. Hanling, can you read? Second paragraph of number three. During my teenage teenage years, yeah, I was very much intrigued in gore, blood, killing, crushing, slashing, and you can name it. Crazy by day and deranged by night, consumed by my own thoughts and striking out of my own void, I could hear the disgust of the public, and I could smell the rigid feel of my family. Drugs, theft, and assault are just mere side tasks in the underworld. I will never do that as they. I just inferior and waste the time to make sense. He was never coming back. Hey, ah,、uh, Rex, ah, you're watching Wu Jiendao, ah, or is that the Hong Xiong Monster? Ah, Zhang Guorong, ah. Ah, Kai Wen. One sad back story of the.、Um, it's watching like those gangster movie, you know. Hong Xiong Monster, I said Wu Jiendao. No, it's the main villain of the anime. It, this is like a sad back story. Okay, okay, but I just very how to how to. The train the 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 back story up before the power up after that. Can someone talk? Hi. Yeah. What? Okay. Okay. Name of student: Shi Hao Xuan's Mother's Day Poem, twenty third of April, twenty twenty one. How Xuan? Can you read to the class, please? Hey, what? Can you read to the class, I, I please? I instantly got scared. I was like, "Wait, Mother's Day already?" Then I looked at the calendar. I'm like, "Bro, it's April." Okay. Ah, wait, this is twenty twenty one or twenty twenty two? Twenty twenty two. You wrote twenty twenty. Oh. In life, there's only something single, and there is many other stuff that is single, but there's only two things that you can. But you, there's only two things that you only have single in your life, your heart. Use your heart and tell someone this. Hey, who's the second single then? For me, I love you, mom. Even if I can't control, uh, control myself and be rude to you, that person is your mom. Wait, is all of this mine? Let's carry on, my dear. Yes, it's all yours. Oh, I forgot. Ah,、uh, there's love, there's hearts, there's flowers, there's many other things that you want, but the only first thing you want to be, is to, uh, be born to get what you want from your mom. So take care. 
Uh, mom, I can give you a flower put inside the flowers are full of hearts, but I still prefer a bouquet of flowers for you and me to stay connected. You are not only my mom, you are a shadow to light, shadow to love, shadow to savior, shadow to hatred, and shadow to life. Thank you, mom. Uh, God, I want to ask you a question. Whose shoulder did I cry on when I'm sad? Who took care of me when I was young? Who played with me? Mom, secrets to share, warm heart. Hands that really care, faith bursting out, love for both and the whole family. You know, when you're reading this last year, it was kind of a bit emotional. And this is the students, ladies and gentlemen, that this boy, from the beginning of last year, for the first three months, never in his entire life had in any homework. Huh? But when he wrote this, it kind of touches a lot of people's heart. Today, we are talking about this. Let's just say that I haven't started working on it yet. Shush. I haven't started working on mine yet. I better start working on it because this is going to... Happy Mother's Day. Before I was born, I asked God who will love, protect, teach, support and help me. God replied and says, the persons who will do all this will be my mother. I'm happy to say my mother is from A to Z's mother. My mother is definitely an amazing mother. My mother is definitely a number one and 100% mother. My mother is the number one to me. My mother is 100% providing unconditional love to me. My mother divides her love for everyone in the family. My mother multiplies her care for everyone in the family. My mother adds every positive ingredient for the family. My mother minus all the negative things for the family. My mother are the best and you are the crest. The Sean family will love you always and happy Mother's Day to my mother. My superhero mother. My mother has lived a life with hardships and suffering. I know I will find all ways to make her feel wonderful. I hope you will take some time for a miracle to be happening. I hope day by day my mother will live a more meaningful life. Back to you. Ready? I would mm -hmm. like Ichi to read this. Oh. When one's child becomes a parent, it opens up many memories and doors. Thoughts, feelings, and gratitude surface that were never present before. Reflections ensue, and aha moments come to light, such as the, the endless depth of unconditional parent, parental love and the tireless effort to always do right. Like when rations are tight, by leaving nothing for yourself, ensuring your child's belly is warm and full because the importance is on their life and health, like respecting your child to make decisions on their own and reinforcing and encouraging them that their life should always set its own tone. These are things you did for me and the things for my own I will do. There's nothing as great as the unbounded love of parenting and for that and everything i say thank you happy mother's day such a beautiful ways you read such a nice sweet voice that's the reason i choose you for this as uh, this point. pokemon i choose you young son this one A gift to keep you organized, a present to help you clean, a gadget for the kitchen. No, that would just be me. Pretty perfume just for you, something for the car. All these ideas won't get my won't get me very far. So much that you deserve. What's your favorite color blue? Oh, it what is the one thing to show you that I love you? I will make you something and of that I will be proud. I know you will love it too. It will be bright. It will be loud. Oh, here is here it is, mom. In bed, wait, the, the texting thing is working. 
in bed, you should stay breakfast at the car on this special Mother's Day. Well done. So yeah, you're done. M is for the million things she gave me. O means only that she's growing old. T is for the tears she asked. She tears shed, is, she shed to save me. Uh, oh, she shed to save me. H is for her hearts of purest gold. E is for her eyes with love light shining. R means right and right she'll always be. Put them all together. They smell, they smell louder. A word that means the world to me. Yeah, that is your mom. Thank you so much. Tianru. My mother is the best. My mom is really great. She's sweet as she can be. When I need some help, I know she's always there for me. Mom loves me all the time, even when I'm a pest. She always takes good care of me. My mother is the best. Thank you. Last one. Cheru, a quarant. Each color is needed to make a rainbow. Each hot wait. My mom is a rainbow. Each color is needed to make a rainbow. Each of her talents make her my amazing mom. She is red. Red represents her energy, vitality, pers perseverance, and willingness, willingness to give of herself. She is orange. Orange stands for her thoughtfulness, consideration, persuasion, and vibrancy. She is yellow. Yellow demonstrates her optimism, concentration, integrity, and energy. She is green. Green represents her honesty, happiness, health, and in tune with the earth. She is blue. Blue represents her love, faith, healing, loyalty, and inspiration. She is purple. Purple represents her leadership, greatness, and use unselfish efforts. Alone. Each color is striking, but when the colors come together, a larger, more beautiful thing occurs. A rainbow is created within my mouth. You are my rainbow. Yeah, well done. I agree with you, honey. Yes, but this is what you're referring to, my mom. Okay. Is Dear Mother, Happy Mother's Day. Whenever we go to the beach, it reminds us so much of you as we talk about you when we walk along the bay. This was written by one of my students. Now I think it's I think around your age, uh, set two or set three. Okay, I'm studying biology in my free time, but now without you, it feels that the clock doesn't chime. Okay, you spelling mistake. Huh? I wonder how, I wonder how you are out in heaven. Because down here on earth, I still think of the things you and my dad gave me when you gave birth. In biology, I'm studying things like generic strip, but when I'm done with the, that topics, I go on to study an anti-genetic strip. Thank you for reading my poem and happy Mother's Day. Is the mom still alive? Kaiwen? Doesn't look like it. Kaiwen, do you think the mom's still alive? Warren? Tianru, Ziye, Yiqi, Yang Zhen, Tianyu. Yes. Happy Mother's Day. Even if I can no longer see you, but I still have one thing from you. That is your 23 chromosome you give me. Happy Mother's Day. I make you a point on the next page. Or you can see what I'm doing when I learn biology during my free time. But if it's boring, go to the next page. So I asked uh, this boy, uh, his name is Rainer. Rainer, 
I know your mom has passed away and his mom passed away because of cancer when he was very young. I asked him this question. So how? Uncle Raymond, I will keep it when the day I die, I will bring this poem to heaven and share with my mom. I think it's not all these things. It's that, then I asked him, uh, I asked him, uh, how long do you do this poem? He can't answer me. He was start, he started to tears. All right. He started to tears and said, okay, it's okay. Uh, what happened? Uncle Raymond, it took me a few days to write this. Why a few days? I did not ask like that. Huh? Why a few days is very simple. Every time when you start, you see, when you start to write this one here, he said, I don't know how to start. This is the first time Uncle Raymond, everyone have a chance to celebrate Mother's Day, but not me. Everyone have a chance to give the flowers to my mother, but not me. Everyone can celebrate the mother with a cake and everything, but not me. Why, Uncle Raymond? I can tell you, can you? Rex, Tian Lu, and Zie. I was very shocked. He was like sitting beside me. I said, boy, it's okay. So what do you think? Now, finally, I can give it this to my mom. Should I burn it and give it to her? Oh my goodness. I tell oh. you, I tell you. Oh, oh man. I, that, that's just sad. Whoever well, well, that guy is, I wish you meet him in real life. And it's, do, do you know what? He was being bullied in school. Yeah, seriously. I always keep this poem because it's so true to my heart, even though it's not with me uh, for tuition for a while, but it's so close to me because I have received a lot of Mother's Day, this kind of poem, but this is one true priceless Mother's Day I will keep even till the day I die. Why? Because it really resonates. I lost my dad when I was young. And one of these boys who wrote, you saw, uh, you saw my cover, every, every lesson plan got that cover. Huh? That cover was drawn and designed by my students. And he wrote this Father's Day, this is Father's Day, uh, F-A-T-H-E-R, right? F stands for forever, I love you, daddy. A is always, you will be there with me. T is till the end, we are together. Oh my goodness, I tell you. Man. When the father received it, uh, he said, Mr., uh, Mr. Raymond, thank you. Uh. As being a chef, I do not have spent quality time with my son. But that, that Father's Day card uh, is so, so many of its ones in the best. Children, it's not about how much you give your parents the, the diamond ring or all these things. You know that kind of poems that you wrote for your parents? Why I say it's a special gift? You only got one mother, one father. Think about it. Don't talk about God mom, God dad. Uh. Okay? We talk about this. This boy took, them, took him a few days to wrote this poem because he was so heart pain. And so cannot, don't know, be more nonsense, you know, don't know how, because he, when he was one, he can't really feel the love of mother beside him. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope that you see, you can use this. You can use this. You can use this. You can use this. Creative. Why don't you do it at this effort? Okay, why I first want I show how Shiena. The first poem or first letter I show about how she is. Okay, a lot of people might think how she is a useless boy, no good boy, whatever boy. No, I never believe that my students are L, a lousy person. I always believe my student is also an L, a leadership person. It's how much you want to build your success and failures, your discipline and determination. Remember, one life, two choice, three reasons that you're going to live for the rest of your life. Okay, I hope this is a Mother's Day, which is on the 8th of May. Of course, you can wish me birthday on that day. That, it was, that, it, that would be my birthday on that day. But I think the most important, I am very proud of that my birthday every four years is coincide with Mother's Day. And guess what? My younger son's birthday also every four years coincide with Mother's Day. So, uh, Han Ling, you say it's a or is it coincidence or is it a plan? I don't know. Uh, so there are seven billion in this world, and you happen to be born in this family with this mother, the mom of a blood of amount of blood that she lost by giving birth. Just writing a simple poem for her. 
this thing. I got this uh, ET. I got this uh, student, uh, a few students. Uncle, I wrote very beautiful. I read it to my mommy. She doesn't speak English. She don't know how to say, I read now. But my mom cried. Eh. You know why not, ET? The mom called me. Uncle, Mr. Raymond, thank you. Ah. I don't have a chance to bond with my son. But that day when he read that poem, I don't know what he said. But the way he read is with passion and love. I really didn't have to say this son. I believe the next path, he understood You see, the words itself, ah, that's why they say ah, the words is mightier than the sword. And it's very true. Seriously. Do you know ah, your mom will not remember so many things that you're, but she will remember those things that you share, sit down and read the poem, all these things. Whoa, priceless. I leave it to you. Okay, I leave it to you. Why I say now? Because you got eight days, right? Eight days to prepare for this poem. I want you, uh, Yang Zhen, Tian Lu, Tao Xian. All of you, Rex, uh, Rex, no need to say that, uh, you will know. Uh. Anyway, Rex, Rex and me, uh, we all have the same birthday on the 8th of May, right? <laughs> High five, right? 8th of May, that's really close to my mom's birthday. Yeah, my, my younger son is on the 13th of May. So, you see, so guys, please, you want, I can stand up again. Uh. I stand up, I bow to you. You want me, I kneel down to you. I stand up now. Why I kneel down to you? What by twenty men? I don't know, uh, seriously, uh, I don't know, Guoren, Tianru, Ziye, Tianyu, Hao, Yang Zhen, Han Ling, Kai Wen, uh, Hao Xian. I don't know next year I will see you or you see me. But I'm so ha happy and grateful that I can see Hao Xian. Hao Xian, uh, do you know your essay was shared with all my set one students two days ago? You know what they say? Wow. And you know Hao Xian? There's another guy called Hao Xian also. That's why I asked your surname. There's one, another Hao Xian said one. Motivated by your this essay that you wrote. You say you yourself, then you continue to learn. Actually, you're not a bad child. Don't ever look down on yourself. If you do that to yourself, blaming yourself, do you do not do justice to your parents. Years they've been brought you up. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you, you have been inspired to do something good, right? Tell you why you're not happy. Uh, well, get ready for you, uh, UFC. No, just, Come on, ready. Uh. <laughs> okay, guys, I hope I want to see your beautiful Mother's Day poem. That will be uh, next Friday. Just nice. Uh, three after that it will be Mother's Day. And guess what? On the 7th of May, that is Saturday, I'm preparing for Mother's Day celebration with all the aunties and aunties left in my zone. That is really priceless. That is where I will see Wow, these are all the mummies uh, who has through a lot of hardship brought up their children today. What you are, Warren, Yiqi, Ziye, and Tian Lu. One day you will be mother, right? Seriously. So let's do something and appreciate. Not say you are four of you are a lousy mummy or a lousy daughter. No, uh. that's why I say because you will feel the different. Uh, Warren, Yiqi, Ziye, and Tian Lu. Can you imagine your children next time? Do the same and happen if we have Can you imagine that for I fish out your poem uh, and show it to your son and show it to your daughter. Huh? Uncle, this is my mommy Quran sheeta. I use so much whatever you do, please don't show any of my poems to my children. No, sorry. Even hey. if you write, because you know why? I you have to thanks how Xian. Uh, Okay, without his approval, I'm showing because I my purpose of being a teacher and motivator is to motivate more students. Because of your work, you motivate more people. I don't take your your handling your your essay. Say, uh, look at this stupid handling essay, lousy. I uh, don't like him like that. Uh, don't follow him like that. Please, for goodness, uh, he's a useless student. I don't want to do this kind of handling. I want to put my students in the light to to showcase. To be, I'm, I'm very holy and very proud to showcase my students his credibility, his ability and capability. That is the purpose. How often uh, do you want to show your legacy to express to more people? Okay? So I hope with that, 